no hiding anything in those suits. I don't think that I was quite prepared for how exposed you are in walking around. And I was okay because at least mine was black. The only thing to do really at that juncture is just to laugh, laugh at yourself, laugh at the situation. Well, it was kind of fun. It was Gillian Sasté. She was uh, great uh, playing Rachel McLaren, the daughter of Admiral Bishop, who's played by Gary Oldman. She was a good sport. We ran around, did all these crazy motion sets with her. and. Uh, so she was game for everything. It was made extremely friendly and comfortable very, very quickly by the other actors and, uh, and by the director and, and the crew. Put your ego at the door uh, and just ha have fun. That's kind of one of the nice things that we're trying to do here is work with you know, really good actors and have fun with them and try and get some of their magic into the digital world. Just another day. Incoming. Stay sharp. You know, I look like um, Sandy the squirrel from SpongeBob. It's just strange to be doing, you know, very, very serious scenes with serious actors when you look, <laughs> when you look like that. Whatever technology was attached to us is picking up every single emotion. It really kind of focuses your mind on, on that this is a serious situation. <laughs> You've also got Gary Oldman and Mark Strong. Yeah, we were going through a list of actresses that we thought uh, would be believable as Gary's daughter and a strong person that would be able to lead the ship. Because so you have to believe that this person is in command, is confident, um, you know, all the things that I think Gillian can do really well. Never gets old, does it? Sir. Yeah, it is. But, so we're going to have Gary on the set and her, but Gary will be at his station and she'll be at her station, but really Gary's on the bridge of the Kugari and Gillian's on the bridge of the Gauntlet. I ordered you to fall back. Can't do that, Admiral. You're dead in the water and we can help you. In our room was the plywood furniture and on the TV it was already surrounded by the ship as it will look. That is just completely new for me and I think a lot of people too. It took a lot of kind of explain, oh no, don't you get it? That's what is going on here. And everybody goes, oh my God. Her gun handling is much better than like, uh, I Other guess. people don't yeah. name names. She looked good. I mean, like, hey, we, you could capture the combat set if you want. Contact! I need some cover now! I think I held a gun on the fall, but when I used to shoot guns on the X-Files, um, you know, it was a Sig Sauer. It was a, you know, a proper um, issue metal heavy gun, and these were uh, pieces of wood stuck together painted gray. I shot at uh, huge aliens. Initially, you know, I was running around in my suit and shooting to a degree, and then Chris said, hang on, a second, let me just show you what these guys <laughs> See, that's actually the size of the creatures. So they're pretty oh, big. Shit. Yeah, and, and this will work on them? Yes. Heavy fire! Contact! Contact! Well, I had a huge amount of fun and it wasn't embarrassing enough to not come back again. It's a great day. Yeah, it was fun. pretty amazing, yeah. Like a dream come true. Julian Anderson and <laughs> Space Marines and Aliens. And it's fun to have uh, like great actors and also people you've sort of seen growing up. They're going to bring the world alive and I think it'll be an experience that people haven't had in the game before. I think it'll make the world much more immersive. We're about to have company. Here they come.